Yo, 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 welcome back. It's the Kickoff FC show. This is your boy, right? 2012, and that's your boy, Dan Roomba. I don't know. I, I can't even talk, bruh. Did that go the way you thought it was going to go? Nope. I can't even talk. What the hell was that, Manchester United? A bullshit. A bullshit. A bullshit. A bullshit. Yo, that has to be. All right, before I ever jump in, I'm talking about the worst match of the season for us. Played against Fulham. That was Sad. the most pathetic, yeah. toothless, spineless performance from the team. I'm growing depressed. I'm growing very, very very depressed. And we're going to cover everything today in this show. We're going to talk about you, Ten Hag. And we're going to talk about the whole team and Rashford and your lazy self. Yeah. We're going to talk about all that because, bro. No heart. No love for the badge. No imaginative. No creativity. What? Yo, it seemed like Ten Hag take the man them lightly, dog. I start debut, like, so we win Forcing. five games. So we just have go tap, tap in at them chest and walk over them. Like say, on an EPL winner with any given day, the man them go beat him. No matter which part them dead, the lowest part of the league or top four. You can't take nobody lightly. No. Rasmus hurt, man. I understand that. Mm -hmm. But that no means that the whole team dynamic has to shift into disarray. Don't even get me started on that. Well, one goal scorer off the field, and we can't find goal nowhere. No, from nobody. Not this time. No. Yeah, well, hold on. Stick a whip up him because Rasmus wasn't in form until recently. Mm. So, you know what I'm saying? So, Rasmus being out the team, yeah, I should be used to that. He just been there five weeks. Exactly. <clears throat> Consistently, you know what I'm saying? Because even in the games when he was starting back in the days, you were well, not starting, he was coming off the bench. Yeah, we didn't get nothing the, from him. Nothing was there. So, so he found a nice rhythm and he's been going with it. So, because him step away, the whole rhythm mush up on the team, nobody else can step up to the plate and score a goal. No, -uh. yeah, tell me, he said the whole team look just lethargic, lazy, unimaginative, lack of creativity. Nothing. I saw nothing from the team. You have 56, 57, whatever amount of percentage of position, but it was all in vain. I didn't see nothing from the team other than the one shot from the low wall at the post, which would have been a golazo right. if that scored. That was a brilliant shot, but it didn't score. So it doesn't matter. So outside of that, I didn't see anything else from the team. You know what I saw from the team? What? The three old horse man them were run out of the back of the freaking defense. Can't stop nothing. The man them can't run down nobody. Them can't they can't even read a game for it save them life. You have Linda Laugh to play left back. Oh my days. You have Bye, Maguire baby. and then Varan. Varan is over the hill now. Well, we know that. We can see that. We now. know that. We the know man that. is almost neck and neck with Maguire, and if you're neck and neck with Maguire, you're awful. <laughs> <laughs> so we have the tree slug them back now. So can't. Oh God. The and game, I mean, we're talking about Fulham game where the man Traore comes on and runs left the entire defense. And midfield together. They just watch the man cruise to go win the game to Awobi. Bro, let me tell you something. This, I'm going to break down this game so y'all can really see what was happening in here, right? So, first things first, we're going to talk about the goal in my score. Zine, because the first goal of Fulham score upon us was, it's off a set play. A set piece it's coming in. A set piece, yes. You're not marking your guy. Come on, man. Is that the team? And then Ericsson. Call him out. And, Ericsson. Hold on. And then they all look around at each other like you didn't have him. You, you didn't. If it's the Ericsson, you didn't have him. You. Well, well, you. Well, uh, uh, uh. I'm like, come on, man. And then all right, fine. That pass. But even when you got over one, is like the whole feeling was like, ah, here we go again. Damn, we're doomed. Yeah. We're doomed. You know. And then. 
All right. And then Harry Maguire's our poacher to score 1-1. Like, think about that for a second. Harry yeah. Maguire is supposed to be our last man before the goalkeeper. And he was the man on the in end of Bruno's shot in front of the goal for, for, for strike team. Madness. Where the rest of the team there? Where the attackers? Uh, Rushford, where you there? Uh, Bruno. Nobody. And then, and then the winner. Let me talk about defense, right? You already hinted at it. Lindelof mm. was a liability on the field at left back. For sure. Zin, and if anybody you wanted to bring up Ten Hag, which we're going to talk about you in a minute. Because if there's anybody that you wanted to bring up from the youth academy, it should have been a defender that could have played left back. Yeah, damn right. Not forcing, not against the youth, because you might have a promise yeah, in the future. He could have been there but, after we start winning the game. Right. And then have him on the bench and bring him on for a yeah. change of PSR or something. Exactly. But then you could have started Anthony. You could have done so much. We're going to talk about you. You could have talked. We're going to talk about you. Start, We're going to talk about Ten Hag in a minute. Yes. Zin, because you done piss me off, Ten Hag. Zin, we're not, we're not going to talk about you in a second. But more get to the team first because the team look lazy. Rashford, they're trying to take on three players at one mm -hmm. time while the rest of the team is running with you and giving effort. You lose the ball. And you didn't even make an effort for try to recover, walk back while clean. the team is... You just look lazy and you're just giving, like, privileged. Like, hey, yeah. like, that's the... You're just giving spoiled attitude, like, where's the fight? For the badge, like, Ruba said, up, up to the badge. Exactly. You understand now I'm that? playing like how I'm used to everyone giving their all, you know what I say? Yeah. Like so let, Gary Neville and the man that they bleed. They know Paul's going like, kick down somewhere. Oh, Who's that the ball there? Kick down Bloody somewhere. Bloody man, I'm going to change them shirt because yo, them man left everything out up on the field. Them boy, you know, care. I'm and gonna, on top of that, I don't think anybody is keeping the team accountable. Like, you're not keeping your teammate accountable. Like, yo, Rumba, you play like crap. Man. Like, yo, yeah, get you. Me know you can do better than this, though. especially if me know. Yeah. You can't play better than this and you're not playing better than this? No, 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 no. I don't see no come, leader. We'll come talk to you me real quick because this ain't going to fly. I don't see no you leader know? on the field. Dog. And you look lazy. You look uninterested. Mm. The whole entire team. See, that is just, that's that part. And then, I'm not even going to tackle the midfield because I won't talk about, I won't talk about Ten Hag. But on the defensive side of things, that winning goal that scored 10, Maguire. Whoop. I was about to give you praise for scoring the goal and being up high. Credit to you mm, on a knock against yeah. Alvin. But on that last goal, Ericsson and Maguire, the ball clear. Ericsson made this wasteful effort for trying to stop the man. We'll get the ball. Mom, and then Harry Maguire, try. you're a defender. In that position, right? Where you are, you have three options. Follow the man and take your yellow card. Mm -hmm. Make sure you get the ball. Or if those two options are not available... Then you cover the space and track back because right. you already know the guy is faster than you. So if you risk it and you miss the man and you miss the ball, guess what it's going to result in? We saw the result. Yeah, for sure. And you already had, they already had two guys out on the flank running with them. So they had multiple options. My, first of all, why they do so high? Why are you above the half line? If we if we merely just come back in at the game for draw the game, the game soon done, you are the center back. Why are you above the half line trying to make a tackle? First of all, then you miss the first attempt. I you see the man that run with left you? Uh, foul, foul the man, foul the man. Man, ball out in my mind. Like, yo, foul, foul. Grab him, drag sitting, two foot tackle, take a run. Anything. <laughs> What is it? Oh Casimir my God. was never. You know, Casimir in my car See, Casimir and then park him. <laughs> park him in a roll off on the sideline. Yeah. <laughs> Casimir, we can't come, right? Straight rip. yellow. Yeah. I could have blue card too. You're bad for a week. Yeah. No. Casimir taking Yo. his red card or at general, least a no. yellow. Yeah. All right. yeah, yeah. We what? definitely would have win. I've drawn the game 1 1. Hold on, no. Yeah. And then, hold on, the chances are we probably would have dropped. Yeah. But then after that, watch Harry Maguire. When you run back, he might coordinate like, yo, you can cover this. Coordinate you what? Cover what? You're running back. You don't know where you're There's bearing. nobody you're there. You're turn. out of position. You're the reason we're under attack. We're under attack? <laughs> yo. 
I, uh, listen, I don't get it. I just don't get it. And it would be for us to say, them go and get them elves, full of them go get them lickings, them losses and all them. My youth. The and man be in a 10 years. Or more. And then when the game that start, the first thing me see when the camera pan to a bench is our record signing in street clothes and a cap. A bun me for some Mason Mount casually having a chat with the man that was suit up on the bench. Like, what are you there for? Who, why are you here, sir? It's just, it's just crazy. But, all right. We could talk about that. Let's talk about Ten Hag, right? Because I'm gonna tell you right now, Ten Hag, your seat is very hot, bro. I've seen I am that. Not all I need to see. I'm not convinced. Yo, all right. Let me say this right off the bat, right? Right off the bat. When a new coach come in, I'm always cheering. We are always cheering for him to be successful. Yeah. But you're not above criticism, and you had time. Definitely We're giving not. you time. But time and time again. Yeah. I've seen Ten Hag make some decisions and I'm just like, what? Let's look at his starting lineup. Why would you put Anthony on your bench? Anthony is your your record son, your guy. Yes. You know? So why would you not start Anthony? Yes, he's not in form, but you bring up a guy from the academy, not against the youth, but start on start Anthony. It's a must win game to make top four. Start this is a Golden opportunity. This is a team yes. that you've never beaten. No, it's not the time. Come on, dominate the game, go quick, and then you can bring exactly. you them and give them a chance. Then guess what, Ten Hag? You don't look like a genius. Instead, now you don't look like a genius. You look like a coach that's out of his depth, that doesn't 100%. know what he's doing. Mm -hmm. And then your substitutions that you made. You bring in Ericsson and McTominay. Atrocious. Ericsson! Ericsson has been proven to be a defensive liability. And not only that, but he's also proven that you cannot play him and Bruno together. Almost like you can't play him and Mason Mount together. It doesn't work. Yeah, it Erickson doesn't work, go. bro. Gotta go. And, and why is it that these coaches are so hard-headed, bro? Bridging. Can't switch why you nothing. can't change your formation? It's like you know, stick to your same formation. Look at your personnel and see what you have. If it doesn't make sense for me to play with four defenders because I ain't got no left yes. back, right, then don't do that. And they what were playing, play? and then I'm going to play inverted wing back. Me see, um, the loo up on the left side to get ball from the, from the center back. So, like, what are you doing over there, so? What, what kind of game plan, what kind of game plan tactics? It didn't look like we had it. Like, yo. Could you know, never. It looked like you expected to come in here because we, of our record against Fulham. Yeah. We automatically assume, which we were guilty of that too. Ah, oh, this is an automatic win for us. We're going to get this. Fulham had different plans. No, though. I didn't think my coach was going to take them on them lightly and put out a bug side out there. Eh? The man of Garnacha tried to tear down the, the right wing for five games straight. And then they go out, go just switch him all of a sudden to the left side. Put Rashford up front with him. Has a Rashford no proof so him can score the goal. It doesn't look comfortable. You don't look here. no way like a striker. But you're gonna put him up front because a Rashford. Just cause I name. And that's why I don't know. We have no, play but, ball if, 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 name. but even if you want to do that, right? Wouldn't you have the same energy with uh Anthony? What do you mean? If you're gonna say, yo, I can play Rashford because Ra it's Rashford. Why not do the same with Anthony? Yes. Play Anthony. As much as as much as we give Anthony a lot of slack, and I'm not saying the young kid forced and performed poorly or nothing like no, that. No, no, no. All I'm saying that. is this was not the moment for you as a coach to decide to play him. Yes. Your tactics were off Ten Hag, right? You didn't play to your personnel because you stuck to your same formation and try to plug I people into place where you You made some changes that didn't make any sense. Why did you bring in? You have Amrabat on the on the bench. Why would you bring in Ericsson with Bruno on the side? Yeah, and you're struggling in the fifty third minute. That don't make no sense to me. But you'd be better off if you brought on Amrabat and McTominay. That would make sense. Yeah. And even so, I don't understand why you even made the subs. Casemiro was not no yellow. Why right, would you right. make? Why? Why did you make and the subs? I can't rest it. I try rest players. Cause we don't even know he's a competition. We're down. 
We're down. We're, we're losing. losing. <laughs> so we're losing, and you're you're. Uh, I understand the Scott McTominay. Scott McTominay one. Cause yes, you want to pull Scott, Scott McTominay in the game to make right. an influence and a difference. I get that. He, when the fifty third minute, he might score. You know, fifty third. Yeah, he didn't even get a at least the sixty something minute, bro. And if you're gonna, if if you started the youngster, you're gonna sub him in the fifty third minute, right? The youngster. Mm -hmm. We need to take him out for the halftime. If you don't see any impact on the game, he's not influencing the game. Take him off for yeah, half time. Take full of light, dog. Hey, Ten hang. This is the most toothless, embarrassing performance from the team, and I Trashy. and I I give it to you because what did you practice in the week? What did you do with the team in the week? Nah. I didn't see anything. I didn't see anything from the practice nah. field. And I'm not even gonna start on Bruno because Bruno looked lost. We said it the last time, you might right? Get the captain on by the last. He ain't lost his flair. My his passing, dog, his dog. passing and shooting boots is non-existent right now, right? Bruno, I need you to get it together, right? But more so, I put this. The, this loss is on Ten Hag. Yes, 100%. number one on Ten Hag. That's the first thing because you did not put the players in a position to be successful. And as the manager, manager, right. that is your job. Piss me off. Anyway, that's my thought. Yeah, man. You know no what way, I say? No way. Let us know what your thoughts are. I didn't even get a chance to plug it or say anything. But, yo, make sure you drop a like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And, yo, if you're pissed, vent in the comment section yeah, and man. let us know what you think. Because this is ridiculous. New was fool's goal from the jump. About five straight and in a farm. Leave it up to my new to no. always miss out on a golden opportunity. And this time... Ten exactly, and the momentum is now shot leading up to the weekend when we play City, the mm -hmm. nice neighbors, but that's upcoming. There's going to be more pressure by Ten Hag. Anyway, this is your boy, Ride 2012. That's your Roomba. Man, thanks for watching. We out of here.